Hello and welcome to this quick video tutorial on changing your material properties in ANSYS. So the first thing we want to do is open up engineering data. Uh, so it says click here to add new material. So you want to just right click and engineering data sources. Uh, and I'm going to go ahead and so up the top here is we've got um, different sets of libraries here. So I'm just, so this here opened is just the general materials one. So if I go and change it to this one, I can get a different set. Not to loads. So I can go to um, other materials that are in here, ABS or something else, or this aluminium alloy. Uh, I also can just go back to this general one. Uh, and then to add it, I just go right click, add to A2 engineering data. And it adds the book here. I think you can also press this button here. Um, so now we're just going to close that there. Now if we open our model. So we've got our model open up and then to change the, the, um, the material, you want to go to the geometry. Um, so open that up and then if you open the drop down, it's all your parts. Uh, so this is named sample part. So if you have multiple parts, um, like you've got an assembly that's been imported here, you'll have all your different parts listed here. And then you go down to material, so it says assignment, so it's been unassigned. Normally that stays as structural steel until you reassign it to aluminium alloy. Uh, so that should now be aluminium. Yep. Anyway, that's all for this tutorial. Thanks for watching.